Hello everybody, I'm Philip Brokham. I'd like to introduce you to Taggy for Evernote. Taggy makes your hierarchical tags act hierarchically. If you're an avid Evernote user like myself, you've probably noticed that even if you arrange your tags in a tree structure, Evernote doesn't search that way. Let me give you an example. I have three tags arranged in a tree with desserts at the top and underneath that chocolate and underneath that donuts and I have a note called the chocolate glazed donut which has been tagged with donuts. Now if I click the donuts tag Evernote correctly searches and finds the chocolate glazed donut. But if I click chocolate or if I click desserts Evernote says no notes were found. This is because Evernote only searches specifically the tag that you selected. And since my chocolate glazed donut was only tagged with donuts it's not showing up under desserts. Now this is a personal preference but if you're like me you might assume that you know if I'm going to click the desserts tag I want to find all the desserts including the chocolate desserts including the donuts I want to find everything underneath desserts. Well Evernote doesn't work that way. The two ways around that are to either shift click like this and search all three tags at once or I could, for example, manually tag my, my note. Right? So I can take the chocolate glazed donut note and tag it with not only donuts, but also chocolate and also dessert. And now it will correctly show up under all three categories. The problem with those two solutions is that, well, they're, they're a pain, they're manual, they're error prone. You know, I'm certainly not going to go through the trouble of manually tagging all of my notes with all of their parent tags. That's just a lot of work. So that's where Taggy comes in. Uh, let me put this back for a second. I'm going to take off chocolate and take off desserts so we got back to where we started from. I have a note here that's tagged with donuts and I want it to show up under my chocolate shirt searches and my dessert searches. So that's where Taggy comes in. Let me go down and launch Taggy for Evernote. What Taggy does well, it says right here, use Taggy to hierarchically organize your notes in Evernote. First, choose the notebook you wish to convert to a hierarchical tag system. So I'm going to choose my Taggy notebook, which I made for this video. That's the one with the donuts. Then I'm going to click the Hierarchify button at the bottom. It says, you are about to hierarchify the tags in the notebook Taggy. Press OK to continue. OK. Taggy is going to do its thing, and it says, notebook Taggy has been hierarchified. Cool. Now if I go back to Evernote, you'll see that Taggy has gone through all of the notes in the Taggy notebook and automatically tagged them with all of their parent tags. So the chocolate glazed donut note is now tagged with all three chocolate, desserts, and donuts. And this is done automatically. I don't have to do anything. It's very easy for me. So now when I search for my desserts, I get not only desserts, but also the chocolate donut desserts, just like I want. Now, after Taggy runs, it creates a log file on your desktop called taggylog.txt. If you open this, it will tell you exactly what Taggy has done. So you'll see that Taggy was adding the tag chocolate to the note chocolate glazed donut. It was adding the tag desserts to the note chocolate glazed donut. And so those are the two things it did. It took my chocolate glazed donut and added the two parent tags to it. Now, if for some reason I, I decide I don't like my tags hierarchified anymore and I want to go back to the normal way of doing things, I can go back to Taggy and hit the unhierarchify button. It says, you are about to unhierarchify the tags in the notebook Taggy. Press OK to continue. OK? And then Taggy says, notebook Taggy has been unhierarchified. Okie dokie. And now if I go back to Evernote, you'll see that I'm back to where I started with my chocolate glazed donut being tagged as donuts but it no longer shows up under the dessert search because now it's only got that one tag. So let me show you how this works with a real notebook because my real notebook is the Stedwick notebook you can see here with 190 notes and for example I have a hobbies tag which with a bunch of hobbies underneath it like books and games and music but if I click hobbies nothing comes up again because nothing is specifically tagged hobbies so let me go to music and underneath music I have guitar and here I have my good riddance tab by Green Day for example but that doesn't show up if I click music 
because unfortunately it's only tagged with guitar. So let me go back to Taggy, choose my Stedwick notebook, this is the real one, and I'm going to hierarchify it. Now this is going to take a few minutes because it has to go through every note and add every parent tag. So it's, what you should do is you should hit hierarchify, then go out and get yourself a chocolate donut, and then by the time you get back it'll be all done. But if you look in the background, you can see as it's going, the hobbies is going up. 21, 22, 23. It's slowly adding all 24. It's adding all the all the notes in all the tags beneath hobbies to the hobbies tag. And you'll see, for example, that the same thing is happening with music. So now my guitar tags, including the good riddance tab, for example, now show up under music. There it is, good riddance. And they show up under hobbies as well. There it is, good riddance. So it is hierarchifying everything as we speak. Now, for those of you who are technologically savvy, what Taggy is literally doing is it's iterating over all of your notes, and then it's iterating over all of the tags and their parents for that note and adding them all in. So that's, that's what it's doing. Um, and it takes a few minutes, and when it's done, everything will be in a hierarchical structure, and you didn't have to manually do anything. There it is. Notebook Stedwick has been hierarchified. Cool. So let me quit Taggy. And there you have it. I now have my hobbies and my music and my guitar and all of my other notes arranged in a hierarchical, hierarchical fashion and correctly tagged with all of their parent tags. So the guitar shows up under music and also shows up under hobbies, for example. And you can use the same thing for your notes. So anyway, I hope that uh, you find this little utility to be useful. I certainly have. And uh, thank you for watching the video.